Headbands are back in stock. That's what I told him to say. Headbands are back in stock. Go to my website if you want to get yours, but they also are back in style. They're always in style. Welcome, welcome everybody. Today is live summer fit sweat party. And subscribe every time. And subscribe every time. I have trained him so well. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel. All right, we're having a party. Can you guys show some dance moves? Oh, no. Woo! All right. So we're going to be doing a full body workout today with your weights. Hey, Cindy is here. Dolores is here. Mary Ellen is here. Sydney, Elizabeth. Hey, Karina. Elizabeth. Yes. Awesome. Hey, Linda. Alozia. Julie. Jean. Mallory. Oh, Mallory says she loves your glasses. Mallory loves your glasses. Thanks, Mallory. Mallory. All right, team. So we're going to be working with your weights today. So kettlebell, dumbbell. If you want to have some mini band close by too, we'll put them in. All right, guys. Say bye. Say have fun at the party. Bye. Have fun at the party. Woo. All right. Oh, you're gonna put your sunglasses on? Put them on. Okay. All right, team. So we are getting it done. Yes, thank you. All right, so we're working with everything today. Anything and everything, whatever you got. We are going to do our party style workout. Hey, Vivi is here saying hi, Olivia. Welcome, Laura is here. Oh no, Olivia is here, but no Tony or Gigi. Well, that's right, tell them I said hi. Um, Elizabeth, are you working out with Mike or Nathaniel or Benjamin? I hope it's the whole crowd today. Colleen from Ohio. Julia, oh, first workout after getting my daughter's cold. It's those back to school viruses, right? Those colds. Hey, Faye, Julia, you can do it. Take your time, listen to your body. You know what I'm gonna say. Just show up and keep moving. So, if you guys remember, we've had some party style workouts, holiday hit, I think we had a sweat party, uh, where we do a circuit where we have a strength, a cardio, a mobility, and then a choose your own adventure. So your last round is whatever you want it to be, whatever you need it to be. If you need more of that mobility, get it. If you're feeling one of those moves or not feeling one of those moves, you get to pick. So it is a no repeat workout. Where again, we're using everything. Use what you've got. Dumbbells, kettlebells, some place to add in some bands. Maria is here. Naomi is here. Heather from Indiana. Miranda from Arizona. Hey, everybody. I love seeing your names and faces. All right, it is hot. We are having a big heat wave in Southern California, which is saying a lot, because it's always hot here, right? But uh, over 100 all weekend. Make sure you have your water wherever you are. I know some of you guys are getting some of that beautiful fall weather, but make sure you prehydrate. Everybody take a sip right now. Give yourself some space and let's just go ahead and start moving. Yes, Mallory loves choose your own adventure. Elizabeth's flying solo today. Mike can catch it tomorrow. Great. Remember these live workouts do stay up on the channel. Can you grab the, this timer too? Thank you. <laughs> um, <laughs> Just talking to my producer, who's also watching the kids, who's also watching his football team. Anybody into college football? Just us. Hey, Julie. Welcome, welcome. I can barely see that, but I think that's Canada. Is that the Canadian flag? Yes, Julie is here. Amanda in Arkansas. Whew, I love seeing where you guys are from, too. That is what's so fun about this body fit community is we are from all over. We see it everywhere, but I see it a lot in the Body Fit Athletic Club. We got a new challenge starting on Monday that I'm going to talk about at the end of the workout. So if you were able to hang out, I always do a brief Q&A at the end. We'll see how much I'm sweating uh, in this. <laughs> I have fans on, but I can't keep the air on during our workouts because of the sound. So it's real hot here today, guys. But we'll do a brief Q&A. <laughs> Have I said that it's hot? Roll through right through here. Um, we will do a brief Q&A and then I'm gonna talk a little bit about what's happening on Monday and it is burn. Burn is starting Monday, that is our next challenge. So get excited. Let's take it to a little squat and a hinge right through here. So sit low and then hinge it. So your squat is dropping the hips and then drive those hips to the back. Gotta adjust these leggings. One is higher than the other. You guys ever have that happen? <laughs> I can just tell <laughs> where it is. Keep it moving right through here. Squat it down. 
and hinge it one more. Let's take it with that hinge right here. Pedal those feet. Yes, right through here. And then let's step it back into that high plank wherever you are. A little forward and back. Press it up and down, down dog. Or stay on those knees, whatever is good for you. And let's take one big step wide. Reach it up right here. You can drop that knee. Jenny is here taking it slow, recovering from illness. Yes, take it slow. Hello from Bangladesh and from Norfolk, England. Hey, Sally Ann, other side, big step, big reach. Drop it down. Good, step it in right here. Woo, shake it out, tap out and reach. I am sore, guys. Mariah watching football, I get it, I get it. Are you perhaps watching Michigan? That is Kurt's team, who he is watching. Um, so, we are going to get it done. We have got four exercises in each circuit. Again, we'll start with a back to basic strength. Sometimes it's gonna be a compound movement, but that is your back to basics. We will have a complementary cardio. So whatever we're doing is gonna complement, they're all gonna complement each other, right? So you know what that means. Sometimes same set of muscles, right? So we get that. Then we're gonna get a mobility that will also complement. Helena is here. And then we will get a choose your own adventure. You pick what you need for you. Not Mariah is a Hawkeye fan. All right. Also Big Ten fan, us too. All right team, so shake everything out. I want you to go ahead and grab either a heavy kettlebell or heavy dumbbells. We're starting with lower body with a squat to lunge. So, whatever you got, I filmed a couple workouts for you guys yesterday and I'm so sore today, so get excited about those and burn. Roll those shoulders back. Here's what we're gonna start out with. We're just gonna do a squat to lunge. We got 40 seconds. You can go one dumbbell in the center. You can have just body weight. It is totally up to you. We got 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest. Make sure you're breathing. Roll those shoulders back. Core engaged all lower body this circuit. So let's get it done in three, two, one. Here we go. Squat it down low. Bring it back up. Lunge it down. Whoo! Little bit of balance. Squat. And then lunge. If that lunge is not right for you, you can just tap it back just to get open up that hip flexor, still push through that front heel. And again, if you'd rather take it body weight, that works too. It's a party today, right? Right through here. 10 seconds. Melissa is just saying hi, playing outside with her little one. Catching up tomorrow or next week. Five, four, three, two, one. Set those weights aside. Now we're gonna get some cardio. So you know what you love it, skater, right? Complimentary cardio. Um, just like we do on all of our party days. If you wanna make a skater, make it a skater. If you wanna make it a disco dance move, make it a disco dance move. Let's get it done. 40 seconds, here we go. Skater, low impact or high, up to you. We just want that cross behind. And again, if you wanna take it party style, staying alive, whatever it is, little disco, up, up. I can't hear the music, but you guys can. <laughs> right through here. Yes, team. If you want to get low, you can. The goal is to keep those legs working. <sighs> right through here. But you don't have to. Up to you. <sighs> Five, four, three, two, and breathe. Whoo, feeling it, right? All right, team. So now we got some mobility. You know it. You love it. Let's lunge it back. World's greatest stretch. Big stretch right through here. You can drop the knee if you want. Step through. Same thing, other side. So you're alternating between the two. Here we go. Lunge it back. Big reach. Drop the knee if you want. Step it in. Bring it up. You decide your pacing on that. 
If you wanna hang out here a little bit longer, really open up those hips. If it's not right for you to get that low, just keep it high. Just think hip opener, little stretch, reach to that side, then back to center. You do you. Be where you are today. Drop it down. Yes. Five seconds right through here. Reach. Boom. And relax. All right, team. Exercise four is whatever you want it to be. You can do your squat to lunge. You can do your skater or disco party. You can do your world's greatest stretch. You do you for the last 40 seconds. I'm going disco party. Here we go. Huh. So you can grab those weights, squat to lunge. If you want strength, if you want mobility, take it with that world, world's greatest stretch. I can talk today. Whew. Remember on the skater, you can get low if you want. If you're squatting, make sure you make them two separate movements. Get down there. And here. Just gonna do a little combo of all of them, right? That's what we should do. Put them all together. Why didn't I think of that? That's your next workout. Five, four, three, two, and breathe. Grab some water. Circuit one is done. Focusing on that lower body, getting that heart rate up. Again, make sure you're breathing. Make sure you get some water, even if you don't feel thirsty, guys. Because when we feel thirsty, that's when our body is already feeling dehydrated. All right, team. So, whew, if you want to keep it moving, take it to that skater or disco party skater. Watch me. We're going upper body. So, two-parter. All of our pull muscles. We got them right here. Let's roll those shoulders back. Hinge, row, up, and curl. Here's what I want to suggest. If you want to go heavy on one and then take this for your last round, choose your own adventure and go a little lighter, that works. If you need to alternate, that's an option too. But we're doing a hinge, row, bring it all the way up and curl. Grab those weights. Join me right here. Three, two, one, down. And up, yes. Take it here. And up, nice and slow and controlled. Back muscles and biceps. A little bit of lower back and hamstrings too, right? With that hinge and curl. Drop it down, keep that chest open. So we're making sure we're not here. If you can see the tops of your legs, you need to adjust a bit to keep that back flat. It almost feels like you're arching, but remember you're not. So here, up, three, two, one, and relax. Set those weights down. <laughs> All right, so what do we get when we get back and we get biceps? We got some punches, right? I'm gonna give you some options. So you can do jab, jab, upper, upper, or you can go four, four. If you wanna dance it, just like that, up to you. But we got 40 seconds. I love the punch. So I'm gonna go with the punch, but you can dance it out too. Let's get it done. Three, two, one. Jabs and uppers. So singles or for two. Jab, jab, upper. Or take it. Four, three, two, one. Upper, 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 upper. Ashley Toddler Meltdown. We can all relate, right? You can do this later. Woo, what do I got? Let's dance it. Yes! Woo. Wish you guys were in here where there's no music, it's just me, and I am rocking out. Four, three, keep it going. Two, one, boom. Catch your breath. Good, shake out those arms. All right, so here's what we got, team. I'm gonna give you a couple of options. If you need to, take it right here. You're gonna reach up with that stretch. Reach up with the stretch. If you're able, I want you to take it all the way down and stretch through here, stretch through here, roll it up in between. So we really work through that spine. Here we go. So you're gonna roll it down either hands here, hands here. Big stretch and rotation. Stretch and rotation. 
roll it all the way up. You don't have to get all the way to the ground. You can take it to those knees and open, open. And you can take it slower than me too. If you need more time in that stretch, go for it. You can also have those hands on a chair, a bench. That might give you a little bit more of that back stretch. And round it up. Let's get two more, like just like that. Reach, reach, or just one is all we have time for. Round it up. That felt good, right team? All right, so whatever you got, you can go back to that row and curl. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna try to go a little heavier this time. Even if I have to alternate the curl, you can take with those punches or those reaches, dance party style, or you can keep it with that mobility. Let's get it done. 40 seconds right through here. Here we go. Hinge. Bring it up. Curl, yes, heavies. Remember, if you need to, you can also curl and curl. You got lots of options here. Or punch, punch, or four. Or dance it. Up to you. Yes, team. 10 seconds. Maybe you're stretching too. You do you. Let's finish it out for five, four, three, two, one. Relax. Yes, team. Quick sip of water. How are we doing? Look at that. We are about halfway there. All right, team. Quick sip. All right, so we're gonna take it with back to lower body. I'm gonna go with a kettlebell this time. Before we do that, we're gonna get a swing though. So we're gonna take it heavy kettlebell or heavy dumbbells. You can do skier swing with your dumbbells. You can do kettlebell swing in the center and you can do a hinge, a deadlift. We're actually all gonna start with the hinge. So grab whatever weights you're using or body weight. Weight in the center. Let's take it here. Let's drive it up. So give yourself a few seconds, roll those shoulders back. We call it packing the shoulders, feet flat on the ground, shoulder width apart, slight bend in the knees, and then bring it up. That is your starting point for all your swings, whatever way you're doing it. If you'd rather just keep it with the deadlift, if that is better for you, or you're not comfortable, or you're new to a swing, keep it there. Otherwise, swing it with me. We're gonna drop it back, power it up, lock it out, let it drop. We got 30 seconds, three, two, one, power, let it drop. <sighs> Remember, you do not have to go high with this swing. Notice I'm not. Let it drop, up, let it drop. <sighs> there we go. <sighs> All the way through, drop it down. Power, drop, power. <sighs> 10 seconds, lock out of the top, zip up that core, squeeze the glutes and hamstrings, and relax. Woo! Right through here, pedal those feet. Yes, team. Woo! All right, weight to the side. Now we're taking it back. We're keeping with some lower body. We got, don't worry, we got core coming up. Woo, sweaty. We're gonna take it side lunge, side lunge, curtsy lunge, curtsy lunge. You're gonna hand off the weight in between. So watch me here, stationary, shift your weight, shift your weight, curtsy and curtsy. All right, let's get it all in. Weight shift, weight shift, lots of outers and inners. Let's keep it moving. Roll those shoulders back. You can shift the weight side to side. You can take it just body weight, dumbbells, kettlebells, whatever is best for you. Let's get it done. Three, two, one. Here we go. Carla's like me. She loves a good kettlebell swing. Curtsy. Step it all the way through. Back to center. Side to side. Curtsy. Step through. Curtsy. So this one you're shifting low the whole time. Then you get up and in between. Curtsy. Step it through. Curtsy. Yes. Side to side. 
take your time. If one of those is not right for you, you just keep regular. You can just do side lunge to side lunge. That's an option. If that whoo, balance is going to miss this, but we'll do it later. Yes, relax, team. I think you are not alone. If that says workouts keep her sane during all the craziness of life, I think that's most of us, right? Shake it out right now, right? All right, so get the back of the legs. We're going to, oh, that's mobility. Oh, my brain today, right? Okay, <laughs> let's take it here. Here's what we got. We're gonna shuffle, tap down, shuffle, tap down. We're gonna keep those legs working. If you are feeling it and you want a little extra, you can grab a minivan. I'm gonna give you a couple extra seconds. It is cardio, but we'll get a little burn for those outers. So up to you, grab that minivan. Let's get it on if you can. This shirt also driving me crazy. Let's get it done. Side to side shuffle or side step. Here we go. Shuffle, side step. And down, shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. It's your cardio. So if you have the band, I don't want you to go as fast as you can, but you can still keep it kind of quick. If you don't have the band, you probably can go a little quicker, right? Yes. Laura loves the combo moves. I love to hear it. Woo, booty, right? Keep it moving. We got 10 seconds of cardio, but also lower body burn. I know. Yes. Three, two, one. Shake it off. Yes, team. Woo. All right, right through here. We're gonna inchworm it out. So we get a stretch through that back, inchworm it out, and then step it or jump it, big step, bring it up, turn it around, inchworm it out. So yes, it's mobility, but it's gonna keep that heart rate up, right? Let's get it done. Three, two, one, here we go. If that inchworm is not right for you, I'm gonna give you an option. Watch me right here. I just want you to hinge. And then I want you to sit low, deep squat. Feel that stretch. Hinge and squat, just like we do in the warm up. You keep it going. I'm gonna fix this shirt. Uh, Heidi only has a 10 pound kettlebell, that is okay. You use what works for you. If you are here and you are moving, remember, you showed up today, you are successful. Three, two, one, and relax. All right, this is it team, this is your last round choose your own adventure i'm gonna take it to a shuffle Whew. let's take it right here i'm gonna take it with the band all right the band is our party <laughs> so you can take it you can do that side lunge into curtsy you can do that little shuffle with or without the band or you can take it with that inchworm walk it up either way last round 40 seconds go onto the mat after this let's get it done Whew. three, two, one, 40 seconds. Here we go. Shuffle, 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 reach, shuffle, shuffle. Whoo, you can make it party style. I guess we really can make anything party style. Add your own flair. Again, don't go super fast with this band. Don't anybody tripping over their feet. You still want it to be controlled, so go in a way that feels good for you. Make sure those shoes are tight. Keep it moving. Yes, team, huh. breathe. We got five, four, three, two, one. Shake it out. All right, team, let's take it down to the mat. But before we do that, how about one more swing? This is a big push for lower body because then we get some upper and core. So grab your heavy kettlebell or dumbbell, whatever you got. One more swing, then down on the mat. All right, team. So, again, start with a few of those deadlifts. Get a feel for that movement. And then if you're ready, if you're able, if it's right for you, we're gonna swing it for 30 seconds. Roll those shoulders back, core engage. Prep it, three, two, one. Power, let it drop. Yes, team, all the way through. Heidi is ready. Julie, you are right. Workouts are better 
then therapy. Shh. Shh. Here we go. Huh. Let it drop. Pull that core in and lock everything out at the top straight line. Then react to it as it goes down. Three, two, one, and relax. Ooh, yes. All right, team, how about, how about we get a little push, upper, and some core? Bring it down on the mat after you grab some water. Come down on the mat with me. Woo. All right, team, good news. I added an extra fan here. All right, so bring it down, dumbbell or kettlebell, whatever you got, team. All right, we're gonna take it right here. So, how come I can't feel that fan? Oh, all right, so we are getting a little push as we drop our toes. Drop, push everything up, right? So drop the toes with that core, and then we're gonna push everything up. That is your strength. Let's get it done. Join me right here. We're gonna get cardio after this, then mobility. We're gonna get it done, because we're almost there. Here we go, three, two, one. Press up, drop the toes. So now we're in our push upper body. Remember we had that pull? Push, and down, yes. And breathe, tap it down. You decide, if that's not right for you, you just add a little bridge to it. You can still get the core working. Woo! Here we go. Core is still working, even if you're doing a bridge, even if you just have that core engaged, but you're not moving through the lower body. It's all working, right? 10 seconds. Shh. Upper body core. Five, four, three, two, one. Relax it down. Nice team. All right, so cardio, this is a fun one. So we're gonna take that little climber. Whew. If you're modifying, you can take it to bird dog. Here's what we got. We're gonna do that little climber where we go here right in and out if that's right for you you can also do it with one knee down where you take it in take it down just like that but we're gonna make it a break dancer all right that's actually often what this move is called so you're gonna take it i want you to think that you are break dancing and really add some style to this either way our core is working our heart rate is getting up let's get 40 seconds lift it up in three two, one, here we go, pull it in, pull it in. Again, lots of modifications. You can just do that tap across or that climber. If you need to stay on your knees, you can do a bird dog. If you really wanna make it, you can bring that arm back. Just like this. If you really wanna get fancy with it, kick it out, kick it out. Whatever you got for you, make it fun. Make it work. Heart rate up. You got five, four, three, two, one. Relax. Yes, team. Woo. All right, double duty here on your back. So take it nice and wide. You can just get a little stretch if you just wanna bring the knee in. That's your mobility if you are able. We're gonna do a big reach, starfish and stretch. Join me, three, two, one. So yes, it's also core, but you're getting that mobility by taking those arms out wide. Really think about arms going wide and over your head, challenge that mobility. A lot of us are tight through there and really trying to lift the leg towards the hand. Flex that foot at the top so you get that stretch. So you're moving from the core, your movement is coming from the center, but you're getting that nice long stretch as you go 10 seconds. And breathe. Five, four, three, two, one. Hug those knees in. So, your choice. You can keep it there with that starfish, get some core mobility. You can take it, break, dancer, or you can take it with that press. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna bring my elbows in to get a little more triceps. Press and tap down. Up to you. I hope you're breakdancing. I'm gonna keep it here. Let's get it done in three, 
two, one, last 40. Here we go. Down and tap. Yes. And tap. If you're doing the press, turn those palms in, bring those elbows in close. We get a little extra triceps. Yes. And breathe. Up. Tap down. Yes. Bring it in. You got this, team. 15 seconds wherever you are. Make it good. Keep that core working. Up and down. Five, four, three, two, one. Relax. Yes, team. All right, bring it up on to your feet. Let's crank out one more swing. Why not? Grab that kettlebell or dumbbells. Let's get it done. We'll make sure we have time for a bonus move. Take it right here. Woo. Core engaged. Let's get 30 seconds of that swing. Hinge it if you need to. Prep it. Three, two, one. Power. Let it drop. Yes, team. Up. Up. All the way through. Yes. Keep it moving. 10 seconds. Lock it out of the top. Strong core. Strong legs and glutes. Arms are getting the work, but not doing the work. Three, two, one. Swing and relax. Pedal your feet. Get all of your equipment out of the way. Woo! All right, team. Shake it out. Water if you need it. We got time for a bonus move. Here is what we got. I want to see your style. I want to see the party. All right. So we're going to take it transverse, transverse. Then we're going to do our twist and knee. Twist and knee. If that's not you, you just go knees here. You can keep it with just that. Or you can add a little pop back. Plank press. Pop it up. Transverse, transverse. Twist and knee. Twist and knee. Pop back. Plank press and up. I know, that's a lot to remember, but you can do it. Don't worry, I got a clock. Let's get our last minute. Three, two, one, here we go. Get low, push off, get low, twist it. Knee, knee, if you want, pop it back. Plank press, little extra upper. Bring it up, right through here, yes team. Down and up, down and up, twist. Me, have fun with it. We are halfway there. <laughs> Faye, you read my mind. Disco bonus move. Huh. Yes, dance it out. Finish strong. <sighs> Summer fit. You did it. Whoo. Down, down, up, up. <sighs> Keep it going. 15 seconds. <sighs> Breathe. Yes. Last five, four, three, two, one. Yes, team. Tap it out. Ha, 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 ha. Catch your breath. Woo! Breathe. Tap it. Side to side, team. Everybody grab a sip of water or two or three, whatever you need for you. Roll those shoulders as we let that heart rate down. Woo! Y'all, I am so proud of you, not just for that workout, but for so many of you who finished Sculpt. This is our last day of Sculpt. So many of you who finished Summer Fit. As I will always remind you, it is not about getting every single workout in. It is about showing up in the ways that you can. It's about moving our bodies in the ways that we can and recognizing that we will have different seasons in life literally the summer season which gets busy for a lot of us and that you will have different days different parts of your journey we have to recognize that we have to go with that and know that the important thing is just to keep coming back so that was my favorite part of the summer is how many of you i've said this in our newsletter last week how many of you said oh i took a week off because i was on vacation I didn't work out on vacation, but I was really active. I got outside. I enjoyed lots of good food. I did not feel guilty, which is everything. 
And then I came right back to this workout and I feel good, or I really missed the workouts, but I really enjoyed it. I love how many of you were able to recognize that that all or nothing thinking gets us nowhere. We don't need all or nothing. We need consistency. We need to keep showing up. We need to keep moving our bodies and that will look different day to day. So it is not about perfection. It is about progress and you're doing it. I'm so proud of you. Sculpt was 25 and 25, 25 workouts of the weekdays. These are all bonus and 25 days, 25 minutes a day. We're going to be doing the same for burn, except we're going 30, but you can do it. I'm going to talk more about burn after this. Let's stretch this, stretch this right here. Make sure you get more stretching as you can. We'll hang out for a few minutes, have a Q and A. I'll give you some info about what's coming up. And of course, whew, don't forget to like this video and subscribe. Like Kai said, subscribe and know that headbands are back in style. One big deep breath in and out. You did it. That was your summer fit sculpt party. Great job, everybody. Woo! Thank you so much for being here. I'm gonna grab my computer or my phone. If you have questions, let me know. Laura, summer fit rocked. Who it did. I am so proud of all of you. You guys give me so much energy. Again, summer is busy. We had travel. We had days that I didn't feel like doing it. We had days that everything looked different and you still keep. Let's see what you've got. Ooh, breathe. Okay, so. Ah, oh, good. Thank you, thank you. Yes, Elizabeth says sweat everywhere. Have a great holiday weekend, everybody. Yes, thank you, thank you. Woo, you guys seem to like the bonus move. I'm glad. Uh, again, Faye, you know me so well. You knew it was gonna have a little bit of fun dance moves in it. Thank you, Elosia, thank you. Heidi had a question up above. I'm gonna try to find it, hold on. Heidi plays baseball. Uh, best workout for baseball players. So, I mean, honestly, every athlete does cross training, right? So I would say, depending on where you are in baseball, you need a lot of that mobility work for your hips when you're getting low, grounding those balls, especially if you're something like a catcher or an outfielder, but all of it, so you need mobility work in the hips. You also need a lot of strength in your lower body. You also really need that shoulder mobility, right? And that rotational movement. So if you have a TRX, TRX workouts are really great for a lot of sports specific tra training. If you don't have that, I would say check out, um, I have a workout called cardio conditioning from last year in October. We did October athlete. Get excited, we're gonna do it again next month. Uh, so I have that, I have cardio agility would really good, be good for that. Um, and then I would think about power training. So any workouts last, uh, no, this week, this Monday's workout was power sculpt. So anything with power in the title is gonna help you generate that power. So I would look for those power workouts and those cardio and agility workouts. Hopefully that is helpful, Heidi. Good luck. Um, Awesome team. All right. Thank you, Naomi. Looking forward to burn. Yes. Yes. All right. Great into the summer workout series. Jean. Yes. Just what Mary Ellen needed me to. Woo. Hey, Monica in Kentucky. I've been so consistent with your workouts and I'm trying to, and I'm changing to a plant-based diet. Good for you. I'm in the best shape of my life. Uh, Julia says my OCD will have me making up those five workouts I missed. That is okay. <laughs> Something about seeing the red lines under your videos of YouTube makes me feel accomplished. I love it. I love it. No, I get it. And as long as you don't push your body too hard, it is always fun to go back and do workouts that you've missed. Um, Zuri is new, but ready for the burn series. I'm so excited. Lisa is reminding everybody to join us in the BAC. Yes, I'm going to talk about that. So, um, first of all, let's get excited about burn. So, so many of you wrote to me and said that you loved the shorter workouts. Again, in August and Sculpt, we did 25 minutes only. As you know, that does not mean they're easier. Sometimes it's the opposite because we have less rest. We really have to push through. I wanted to give us a little more time this month. So they're 30 minutes or less. Some of them um, might be a little bit less, 
but I think you'll still find that you are able to get them in, that you are able to rack them out. So get excited about that. Get excited about the title, but remember burn means everything, right? We're burning our muscles. We're gonna feel the burn. We're burning calories, all of those things. We're burning fat. Um, and you're gonna be on fire because you have that fire in you. What is happening with, <laughs> sorry team. Woo. Hopefully that didn't sound crazy. Uh, I just noticed in the reflection of the camera, but my headband was all the way back here. Um, so get excited about all of that. It is going to be a fun month. It does not mean that every single workout you're just gonna be uh, you know, so super sore. It just means that we're gonna challenge our bodies, all right? So get excited about that. 30 minute workouts all month long. If you want to join the burn challenge, of course it is completely free here on the YouTube channel. Make sure that you are subscribed. Make sure, this is super important, that you sign up for my weekly newsletter. On Sundays, we send out a newsletter that gives you your weekly workouts and a link. Tomorrow, you'll get the monthly calendar as well, but you'll get the links early. So if you're someone who wants to do them early or create a playlist, that's a good way to do it. So check that out. Make sure the links are in the description here, but make sure that you are on that email list. Um, so get excited about that. And then if you want to join us in the BAC, we have tons of our Body Fit Athletic Clubbers joining today. Karina is here. Jenny is here. Lisa is here. Mary Ellen, all of you are here. Jean, they can tell you it is such a fun community. If you want that extra support, if you think you just really need um, extra support, extra accountability, if you need nutrition help, especially because we are the platform that has the full-time dietitian. Vivian is amazing. She is not gonna tell you to stop eating your favorite foods. She's not gonna tell you to count calories, but she is gonna help you heal that relationship with food, learn to love food. All foods fit into our program. It's about getting the good stuff in. So if you want that nutrition help and if you want more of that access, that direct access to me as your trainer and Vivian as your dietitian, that is where you want to be. So discount codes should be in here, but you can use the code sculpt. You can get half off the first month. You can use the code bodyfit100 to get $100 off the year. Let me check on your questions. Ah, oh, Carla is in the best shape. I'm so glad. Oh, Linda, I'm so glad that, that the workouts are therapeutic for you. I feel the same way. Exercise does that, right? Kate, first challenge and I'm hooked. I'm so excited. Uh, there is nothing better to me, I said this last week, than seeing someone get excited about working out. That is the best result. That is my favorite. Maria took a week off, was very pot tired and my body needed a break. Good for you, listen to your body. And then you came right back, yes. Um, let's see, Mallory's asking, Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> the, the, uh, the, the promo code is burn, not sculpt, because sculpt is done. Burn is coming up. So promo code is burn. You'll see it everywhere. Uh, Mallory, do you know I have a good way to stretch or massage mu muscles in the upper back? Trapezius, I've been so tight and painful. Yes, so Mallory, I would say first thing, really be aware of how much time you spend. I know you got the three boys, so you're not spending that much time, but here and here, because we get super tight there. The other thing I would say is if you have a foam roller, and even if you don't, a tennis ball. So I've got my little small roller here, but you can go up or here. You can either align it here, side to side, or just here. Just be careful of your neck. So what I would say is just holding into it and let your body sink into it, or right through here, and kind of gently be right in here. But also you could just put a tennis ball or a therapy ball right underneath. The other thing that's super helpful is if you can grab onto something like a railing or a sturdy chair and really sink back, that can help with that. But usually the culprit is we spend too much time like this. Hopefully that helps. Um, oh, Jody, good question. When is the new gym space gonna be done? Soon! <laughs> I know we've been saying that forever. We've been waiting on an installation um, and some inspections, but uh, we're actually seeing some movement on that this week. So hopefully within the next month or so. Listen, you guys will hear all about it. I'm gonna do a little before and after video, a video of the building and um, and we'll give you a tour, you'll be the first to know. But hopefully soon, um, if anybody has done construction before, they know that it's a lot of that hurry up and wait. Felt like a lot of stuff gets done really fast and then we have to wait on the city, on inspections, on installations, on things like that. So hopefully soon, new studio, Body Fit Studio, coming soon. All right, yes, everybody is loving the BAC. 
So, um, uh, yes. Oh, good, Jean, uh, Jenny. I'm so glad that you're feeling better. Feels like a cold, lighter weight's good for you. All right, anybody have any other questions for me? It's a holiday weekend for those of us in the US. Enjoy it. It's a weekend. Enjoy it. Um, remember that we, you know, this is something that we talk about all the time in the BAC. We don't believe in things like cheat days or, oh, I'm only going to, I can do whatever I want on the weekends, but I'm super strict during the week. It is all about finding that balance, but you don't have to do it in a way that feels like you're cheating or things are good or bad. That is what we talk about, especially when it comes to food, but also taking breaks from exercise. So I'm so glad that you joined me today. Um, if you want to know what the difference is, is that you get so much extra support. You get so many extras. Uh, Vivian and I both go live every week. We do general Q and A's, but we also cover topics this month on the nutrition side. Vivian is talking all about sugar. People have so many questions about what's the difference between added sugar. What is, is honey better for you? Is maple syrup better for you? What about sugar alcohol? She's going to be breaking that down. She really lets you know about the science and what is actually happening in our body beyond the hype, beyond everything that gets marketed. She's going to tell you what's really happening. Um, and I'm going to be talking about targeted zones, right? So a lot of times people say, I really want to get more out of really feel my glutes or how do I really make sure I'm engaging my core or I never really feel my upper body. So I'm going to be breaking those down in my lives as well. So, so many fun things happening that if you have questions, that is where you're going to get your questions answered in depth and in a personal way for you. So join us there. Thank you so much, everybody. Again, headbands are back in stock. You can go to the website and get them today. Um, we do ship internationally. Uh, and as Kai said, headbands are back in style. Thank you so, so much. Thank you, Dolores BAC is much more than a typical online community. I agree. It is a family and we have so much fun and people are showing up and being consistent and improving their health and feeling good about it all. That is the best part. All right, team. Thank you so much. Have a great weekend, everybody. I will see you on Monday for burn.